as i already mentioned many times that a collaboration is a key of the success so always try to work in a collaboration don't work in silos so you have a international collaboration that's very important and always treat your own phd student as a potential collaborators so if you work you treat your students and as a collaborators uh, and they will be lifelong your collaborators and when they go in a different part of the world especially in my case my students in, in all continents so th- uh, that's change the perception and uh, your research can be outreach in those countries also when we are in europe you know psala we don't do an, any administration so their secretaries run the show actually they run the department they run the institute they run the universities so professor role is very limited they just focus on their research or teaching and the all the balance how much funding is left this is kept all kept by the secretaries so when the money finish they will tell okay fund is over in that account you should use other account or apply more money but when you come to india as a director director plays very key and important role not only making the policies and that making the direction where institute have to go but he has to work very closely with the staff and faculty so sometime in the end all decision depend on a director so that director has a ultimate say so that's uh, put a lot of pressure as a own director so as a contributing to researcher you can do freely research now all of a sudden you have to do administration also and when you are a director your 75 to 80% time goes in administration so administration take more time and uh, i also learn uh, when i came to india and become a directly as a director so it was the first 6 months was very difficult one to understand the indian system and to understand the people also and to to understand the working culture also which is totally different so this is was a big task in first 6 month and uh, i feel a lot of pressure in first 6 months so you always worried that you should not make a wrong decision so you are always very conscious that you feel a lot of pressure so administration take a lot of time as a director rather than your own research become the back end i will like to mention that this is a very important part what if you look at the in indian scenario so when i, I we talk iits graduate or undergraduates so they are all focus on the it more in computer science or information technology but when we talk about materials you cannot develop a fast computer without having your chips material science is going to play key important role in the coming century whoever have the best material who have the more semiconducting materials or the semiconductor whoever control the semiconductor that country will lead the uh, world the semiconductor will be the i will the future the asset any country who has a leader in semiconductor they will lead the world so material science is very important so we need a new material or innovative material for example for solar application for or green energy application or we talk about hydrogen so if it all depends on the material without material we cannot do thing so material science is going to play a key role now if india wants to develop as a manufacturing hub of the world as i already mentioned you have a very state of the art facilities and the infrastructure which i will say that as your director already mentioned that uh, and they want to grow also through research and when we talk about research the future institution or university they have to grow with the research and innovation when we talk about research we talk about not only academic research we talk about translational research where research can translate to some startup or some kind of prototypes which can be scaled up by the big industry so research and innovation innovation is the the way to grow and especially the younger universities like uh, your university can play a very key important role because your faculty is young so it's very easy to mold the young faculty it's very difficult to mold old institution to bring back and to change the mindset
yeah of course uh, as i told you already that uh, so when you come from a european mindset in europe we treat everybody as equal right so for us private university or government universities or iit they are all equal for us because we have to work with those people where they can we can use our expertise to, for them and we can use their expertise otherwise you are working in a silos so we should not be biased that okay we, we will not going to work with the private university or we are not going to work with that institution it doesn't matter from which background you come which institution is it works what kind of intellectual power you have and how you can contribute and there are good people everywhere it can be in private institution also it can be government institution also so we have to change that mindset that we should not use the word i will grow we say that we will grow and we grow together to achieve the goal where india want to be a wish guru and this should be our also vision for 2047 as a vikshit parth